I made a video a while ago about writing drums in Reaper. I showcase a bunch of tips and tricks that I got for super fast writing. I highly suggest checking that out if you haven't. In that video, I talk about two things that I think are very important when it comes to writing drums. And one of them is the fact that you can double right click any note and just add any name to it and it will appear in here and when you click on it you will see the name of the note in there and this thing is amazing you can load your own drum map and all of that and then you can change to name note view to see them all clear like this and the most mind-blowing fact of all of this is that you can simply hold command or control and drag any of the notes to any position that you want. This is all amazing and it's such a massive improvement to your workflow. However, there's a catch that I didn't talk about in that video. The thing is, you kind of miss a very key functionality, which is being able to move stuff up and down. For example, this you're able to move because they're next to each other. These notes are next to each other. But what if I move the snare over here? Now, if I move the kick up, it's just gonna stay there. It's not gonna move past there. So um, I completely lost my ability to go up and down and being able to addition the notes that way. And it's annoying. Like uh, my only way around it was just going with my mouse and going up and down. But I lost my ability to do it with the keyboard and that that's annoying. There's a feature request about this in the forum and the link is in the description and I highly suggest you support it. Like you should be able to go up and down with your keyboard even if you're in a custom note view. Now there's actually a workaround and it's in the form of a script. And in the description you will see a download to the script and some instructions on how to install it. And the way you use it is super simple. You will find it in the actions menu, make sure that you are in the section MIDI editor and you just need to set a shortcut to these two actions. One is to go up and one is to go down. So now that I have this map, I'm able to, let's say, a bunch, add a bunch of crashes in here. And maybe I don't like those crashes and I want to go up and down to hear the other things that I have available. I will use these shortcuts to go down and up. So now I'm able to audition and go up and down. And if I try to do this with the native actions of going up and down, it's not going to work. You'll see. I'm doing up and down like this and it's not working. But if you're in the custom view, you just use the script and now you're able to go up and down without any issue. So yeah, that's it. Check the description for a link for the script and the instructions and all that. And also make sure to support the future requests so we don't have to actually do this and it should be native. Like we should be able to go up and down. It, it just makes sense. So yeah, that's it. Bye.